Hi, babe. Happy 40th birthday. <laughs> I can't believe that you're 40. <laughs> FYI, I'll be 40 in two weeks. But you know what? We don't feel 40. I know you do sometimes with working, but hey, I think we look mighty good for our age. I know what you're thinking. Okay, my wife is fixing to be a little extra for my birthday, but why wouldn't I? Baby, you're my rock. You're my best friend. You're my soulmate. I couldn't imagine doing life without you. You bring so much joy into my life. And from a girl that they call the ice queen in high school, I've never knew love till I met you. And how little did I know at 14 years old, I met my soulmate. But in high school, you know, all I was about was making my career happen. But God seen us back to each other. And I really believe that he saved and let me learn life a little. And then he put you back in it. So here's a little tribute to you and how I feel about you and how much I love you. Happy birthday, sweetheart. I love you. I've heard dependence is weak That I shouldn't need anybody else They say a powerful girl Can conquer the world if she's by herself My roots run deep And my heart and soul's with
penance is weak That I shouldn't need anybody else It's me again. <laughs> I know you're probably getting a little teary-eyed because you do that, but you know my dad does. So they always say a real man shows his feelings. So another thing I want to say, I really do believe that God brought you into Joseph's life. You're the best dad he could ever ask for. You go above and beyond to show him that he is loved. And it's not just about materialistic things. It's what is in your heart. You do for him without asking. You come to my mom, you come to me, and you say, what does he need? When Joseph got hurt, you was my rock, the biggest one of all, because you stood by me from day one. When I was bullied by the hospital, they told me there's no hope. You looked at me and said, they don't know him like we do. You stood by my side. You got him into shepherds without me even having to ask. You have been there every step of the way. You would work and come visit him after work. I have seen you drive hours from Atlanta to Savannah just because he had to be put in the hospital for something minor. How many times have you been to the hospital and sat there and held his hand? When he was in a coma and he didn't answer to nobody, you were the first person that he responded to. He put his thumbs up and you said, are you a daddy Michael's boy? And he always called you Daddy Michael, but when he started calling you Dad, there was just a thing about it that just, it just warmed my heart. Because he loves you unconditionally. Because he knows you love him in unconditionally. So here's a song, and I know you're going to tear up, but me and Joseph love it. And he says, this is yours and his song. So I hope you like it, babe. And get tissue, because I know you're going to cry like a baby. He ain't got my smile that don't bother me a bit He's got somebody else's eyes I'm seeing myself in I'm holding on to every moment God knows I missed a few The day we met I knew I had some catching up to do he ain't my blood, ain't got my name But if he did, I'd feel the same I wasn't there for his first steps But I ain't missed a ball game yet And that ain't ever gonna change I could never walk away Yeah, he's my son and that's my choice He ain't my blood, but he's my, he's my boy me like a train the first time he called me dad in a three stick figure crayon picture with all of us holding hands his mama said i understand if it's too soon for this i didn't let her finish and took it to the kitchen and i stuck it on the fridge yeah he ain't my blood ain't got my name but he
He ain't my blood, ain't got my name But if he did, I'd feel the same I wasn't there for his first steps But I ain't missed the ball game yet And that ain't ever gonna change I can never walk away Yeah, he's my son and that's my choice He ain't my blood, but he's my He's my Okay, I'm through. I'm actually through now. I just want to say one more time that we love you. Mama, Daddy, me, Joseph, we all love you. Your mom, your dad, anybody that knows you knows that you give your heart. But you don't take no crap now. But you're a good person and you'll give anybody a chance. But like me, once they screw you over, you're done. But baby, thank you for always being there. Thank you for being my rock always been there for Joseph and not just for the hospital and holding his hand through all the football games and stuff that you didn't have to go to. You were the, you were the dad that you didn't have to be. And we love you for that because it takes a man to step into a situation and never look back. And then an accident like that, or excuse me, not an accident, but something happens like that. He could have left. Nobody would have blamed you but you were there the whole time. You were there when I found him and you've been there through the whole journey. So I love you. And thanks for just being you and being good to me when everybody knows I can be a pain in the butt, right? So happy birthday, baby. And here's to many more years because I look forward to growing old with you.